So if you're a PC gamer that is tired of sitting at your desk playing FPS games with mouse and keyboard and just want to relax on the couch with a controller and play a good RPG or platformer, well, connect your PC to your TV using your HDMI cable and open up Steam and I will show you how to enter big picture mode that will give you a console like experience on PC. Okay, we have Steam open, and I'm gonna show you the quick and simple way to get the big picture mode, and that is to come up here to the top right, click on this little computer icon, it's gonna say enter big picture mode, and this will automatically take you straight into big picture mode. And if you have a controller connected to your PC, you can start navigating big picture mode using that controller. I am using an Xbox Series controller, you can also use a PlayStation 5 controller. Let's go ahead and go back and we're gonna go down to power and this should kick us out of big picture mode and then exit big picture mode. Now I'm going to show you how to have a real console like experience to the point where you can leave your PC hooked up to your TV if you would like. And the only thing you will need to start up your PC is a controller. That is unless you have a pin code as security, then you would need a keyboard as well. Okay, let's go up to the top left click on steam go down to settings and then go to interface and what you want to turn on here is run steam when my computer starts this way as soon as you log into your computer steam will automatically start running and you also want to turn on start steam in big picture mode this way when steam does load it won't load into the desktop version instead it will load into big picture mode now if you want to go ahead and test this out to see what I'm saying, at this point, go ahead and restart your computer. So when you restarted your PC, it should have loaded you right into Steam Big Picture Mode. Now I can show you how to navigate this using your controller. And again, I am using an Xbox Series controller. So we're going to hit the B button to go back. If you want to get to your games, you can go right here to library and you can scroll through and you can select whatever game you want to play that you have downloaded. Let's go back. If you want to navigate the store in big picture mode, you can do that as well. You can go to store and you can easily scroll through using your controller. You can get to your friends in chat. You can check on any games you may have downloading or any updates you have going on. And you have your settings. And these are all the same options that you will have available in settings if you was on desktop mode. And all the way at the bottom, you have power. This will give you the option to turn off system, which will shut your PC down. So like I said, giving you that console experience, you don't even have to use your keyboard and mouse. You can restart your system. You can change your Steam account. You can minimize Steam and you can exit big picture mode or exit Steam altogether. So yeah, this mode is great for people who don't like being tied down to a desk or who wants a better gaming experience than what you would get on console, but will have the same benefit as a console gamer will get by relaxing on the sofa. So if you haven't gave big picture mode a try, now may be the time to do so. Thank you guys for watching. If this video was helpful, leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And hopefully I will catch you in the next one.